so guys uh we can now understand better why most of the people from the north especially christians from the north are not really happy about the choice of running mates of ebola metinumbu it goes beyond politics and also people have been throwing a lot of things against uh, dugara and baba chelawa because these are the two people who are fronting this uh, cause and we have been seeing Tinubu meeting with a uh, northern christian uh, clerics because i said it in one of my videos uh, what i said there was that there, there, there was no need for Tinubu to be calling all these people because you knew quite all right what this problem is going to generate but that being said the last uh, set of people that Tinubu meant this a uh, northern christian clerics of course katakata don't boss of what they collected and what they did not collect but the main concentration of this on this of this matter is the when they were telling try to tell Tinubu their grievances the reason why they are not supporting this whole thing because they know what they have suffered when it comes to religion people say oh forget it the religion does not matter but those who wear the shoes know where it pinches them and one of the clerics or the bishops that met uh, with Tinubu was explaining uh, his name is a uh, uh, Biyang Bishop Biyang I think that's his name yes his name is a uh, 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 Reverend Danjuma Biyang he's not a bishop Reverend Danjuma Biyang and he explained a lot of things he said Christians are not allowed to preach their faith in government owned media houses in some states the teaching of christian religious studies crs or bible knowledge uh, which we call bk has been banned in public schools in many states including borno in which the ban was done by the man he had chosen to deputize for him and the same tinubu now saying that he didn't know all of that because they made him to understand that he what the way religion is being practiced in the in the north is different from where it's being practiced in the south because you think that everybody is libra and what have you but it is a different board game entirely and the same tinubu told us one time that a shetima built a schools he built churches and people said this man he don't know what you are talking about but now they have made him to understand but some people said since tinubu is even denied that he didn't know of that that is a lie that he cannot say he's not aware but that being said if he didn't know but now he's aware the reverend has been able to tell him that even the man that you are you have chosen to be your running mate he did the same thing in Bono state he said christian students are denied admission into public universities and other tertiary institutions and the few admitted are denied their choice of some professional courses like medicine can you imagine engineering law accounting which are needed for nigeria's development that they are not they are denied choices of some professional that the few ones that are admitted christian students that are denied admission into public universities and other tertiary institutions and the few that are even admitted are denied their choice of some professional courses like medicine engineering accounting law which are needed for nigeria's development what does that tell you things that would develop the country they would deny them because of what because they are christians so this is no matter of a uh, people are just uh, you know it's propaganda 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 i'm sure when you ask Kayamuna, you begin to talk off points he knows the truth oh because that's why a lot of people are surprised he knows the truth and somebody who knows the truth and you look the other way the person is wicked you cannot tell me that uh, he will not know that that is a very very is a dangerous trend so if you are hearing people talking they are not just talking for the it's for the sake of it but they know exactly what they are talking about some people are talking about say oh if you vote a tinubu now it's a vote for tetima and which is true if somebody who has not even attained the position or they have not even won election he has already shared the position that he's going to, he's going to do this he's going to do that is that not a, a, a red flag is that not the red flag but some people especially from the south eh, southwest say eh, they don't even know what is happening majority of them don't even know what is happening now where is your man now is a problem sinubu cannot say he is not aware where is a very intelligent reply to sinubu some of the issues he raised are not known by many christians in the south 
depriving the salary present children from studying certain courses. Our high is not open now. And his deputy is one of the architects of the problems in Bono State. You know, when they talk about Boko Haram, they think they are joking. I think with that picture, they have not even come out to deny it. That picture that they saw, the the Boko Haram people that they saw him with eating with them, and the so common that one of the Boko Haram leaders that they saw in his lodge, government lodge, they have not come out to deny it. They have not come out to deny it. They have not come out to deny it. Yes, they intend to divide your rank with corrupt money. Your steadfastness will be proven by resisting the devil. There's nothing wrong okay, for Christian leaders to interface with candidates, but you have to be careful. You have to be careful. Bishop, you and Northern Christians should be careful with Sinobu. Remember all their promises in 2015 and 2019. See, today, don't let him use the head of Northern Christians again. These people are evil. Shetima is an evil man. He does not even want to see Christians in Nigeria. <laughs> okay, oh. Reverend, please go and see no more if you really collected money. None that Christians are aware that Igbos are worse than Boko Haram. E? Oh my God, eh? they are aware. Mm. Well, desperation for power can cause anything. Why being too desperate? Now only you, the Niger. Nothing will... We no go here. So Christian religious studies and Bible knowledge are banned in public schools in Bono State and some parts of northern Nigeria. And these people are preaching one Nigeria deception. And you expect Christians to vote for such candidates in 2023? If Nigeria was created for only them, Christians would know if God had not seen all this and provide escape routes through another candidate can you imagine <laughs> wonders they say shall never end though well it was good that he attended you just just like you said his reaction after your talk was an eye opener to bola metinubu and i will tell you it's also an eye opener to many other nigerians and christians in in particular who play down the muslim muslim ticket <laughs> of course which is true they are playing down on it and those come to paint the picture that shetima has been good to christians now it is the public we it is in the public we can see that same faith ticket is a very dangerous signal yes but Tinubu and apc are using the meeting for campaign strategy for election day and pretending that those who attended the same meeting are his supporters. That is why all Christians are against the well planned meeting the APC is using to deceive other Christians. Can you imagine? Well, you just have to be careful. That's just it. You guys need to be careful. I think uh, it's an eye opener. Some people, for where I don't know what is going to move some people, but at least for those who are deep thinkers and those who are discerning, they will know exactly what this will turn. So, guys, leave your comment down there below and let us have your take.